What's up, guys? So we're getting ready to watch this one. It's called ESP Science. I have no idea. I clicked on it uh, just to make sure it'd play right because a couple of her videos I've clicked on and they don't play. Like, I already did a reaction to this one. It's part four. This one up here is going to be part five. And now I'm going to do that one as part six today. So you'll get these three videos tomorrow as a members only. So... Here we go. Was ESP extrasensory perception. And so we can read the comments here, and a lot of people are fucking pricks. I'm sorry. Greetings from these people. Hi, Nikki. I'm Ryan from Southern Africa. Hey, how's is the book going? Hi, please make more videos. Greetings. Okay, so these people are actually being nice. There's a lot of people that are not nice to her because of her her past. Uh, she used to be a adult uh, entertainer. And if you know what I mean, you know what I mean. Like when she was younger. So this video is right before she went to prison, where she went to prison for like three years, I believe. Uh, she says five, like in the videos that she's making now, like this is from four years ago, but like it's, this is a four-year-old video, and she just recently got out. That's only like three years, maybe four, but I doubt it. Like it's like three years. Uh, but she says she's she was in prison for five. It, maybe it felt like that. But here we go. Let's see what this video is all about. Hey everyone, this is Nikki Blue, and I just wanted to talk to you about the ESP site. Nikki Blue was what her stage name was. And something else, uh, I can't remember the other one, but she had another stage name. Uh, but that's the other her other YouTube channel, which is, I can't remember it, but... In this book I am writing, and I want to talk to you guys about it and uh, I'm excited to finally be back to my writing and not caring about what other people think or what I think but one thing I was Here, like here's like in these two in the other video I caught her in a bunch of stuff too like in this one too like the stuff she's saying now like in her newer videos that are just recently coming out she says she can't write she doesn't know words. She doesn't. But in this one, she's saying she's writing a book. And she's glad to be back to writing again. So it makes me wonder. It just makes me wonder. If some of the new stuff she's saying. Is made up to get people to feel sorry for her. Like, I don't know. Like, her story is pretty messed up. But it makes you wonder if that's a possibility with growing up was ESP, extrasensory perception, and my whole life it's plagued me, so I thought, <laughs> and I've always tried to hide it, cover it up, not talk about it, and all that ever does is just hurt myself and everything like that. And one thing that I've been noticing in the media lately is they're finally coming out and saying, well, humans can sense electromagnetic fields. And I'm like, finally. And then in the article, of course, it says an ESP doesn't exist, yada, yada, yada. And then, of course, NASA came out with an article saying, oh, you know, this solar storm's happening, and don't be surprised if your intuition all... This is, like, she already knows she's going to prison. So this wasn't before she did what she did. She already knows by the time this, this video, these three videos that I'm going to react to, she already knows she's going to prison by these three videos. So... From the time she was in prison until the time she got out of prison, she wouldn't have got dumber. Like, she's pretty damn smart, and the shit she's saying is pretty damn smart. So in order for her to be 
messed up and worse by the time she got out of prison, which was, would mean she got the shit that messed her up when she was in prison. Because she seems really smart here. She's saying big ass words. She's she's not stuttering her words. But her newer videos, she acts like she can't say bigger words and she stutters her words and sometimes in the middle in her videos she's like doing this and like she's passing out and shit. So watching this, knowing that this is right before she went into prison, makes me wonder about the videos now. Did she get that way in prison? Did they treat her that bad in prison? Or is she making stuff up now? Just just something that's on my mind. I don't, I don't have a clue. But what do you guys think? The sun works and you're manic and you have psychic visions. What? You guys just got through saying the other day that there's no such thing as psychics. There's no such thing as ESP. And then the next day... There's definitely such thing as psychics, but there's also such thing as bullshit. Like, I believe there are psychics. I believe there are people that foresee things happening. Everybody sometimes sees something before it happens. So, we all got... We're not all psychics, but we all got a sense of things that... Sometimes we see before it happens. And uh, deja vu happens all the time. Like, that happens with a lot of people. Uh, it's like you've been there, but you know you've never been there. That's another form of psychic. And we all do this kind of stuff. So psychic, I do believe there are people that are way above just a casual psychic experience. There's people that actually can do it. But there's also people that are do it just to steal your money and they have no fucking clue. They're just figured out a way to scam you. So you got to watch out when it comes to psychics. Come out and say, yeah, it's real and you might experience this because the son just had a fart. <laughs> I'm just like, thank you. And then they cleverly renamed it to ESS. Because guess who has ESP science owned, bitches? Um, boom. Yes. <laughs> and they don't want my book out for sure. And of course, when it does come out, they're just going to go, oh, she's just a Looney Tune felon slash crazy person talking about Kim Drills and aliens and UF fucks. This is four years ago that she said this. And the chemtrails is a way of blocking stuff out. And a lot of people are like, no, it's just something that goes behind the plane or behind the jets when they when they go. Yes, you're right. It is something that goes behind the jets. But what are they putting into that shit? They're also our government, and you can go look this shit up, because it's fucking real. It's on Twitter. That's where I found the information. And then go look it up yourself, because you'll be like, well, everything on Twitter is not real. Go look it up. They're thinking of ways to blocking the fucking sun. And the way they're going to do that is with chemtrails. And she was talking about this four years ago. So she's pretty smart. She doesn't act this way anymore. <laughs> That's okay. Because I don't care anymore. And I'm going to announce my crap. And you guys can just suck it. Because that's what I'm going to do later. Gator. But, um... ESP science is some pretty fun shit. And the first thing, first lesson about ESP science I have to tell you guys about is how it works. Mm -hmm. We all actually have the ability to do psychic things. But of course... Exactly, that's what I just said. We all have 
different psychic things that happen. We all do. We all have some type of psychic. You might not believe it, but we do. Nobody really knows how because, you know, when Hollywood and all that, it's just, you know, superheroes, mutants, and blah de blah 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 And how it works is if you try too hard, it don't work. If you think you can do it and you're egotistical and your ego's like, I got this, bitch, I got this, won't work. If you think, oh, it's not going to work, I'm a loser, not going to work. Yeah. It, to me, it it's not, it doesn't have anything to do with how you feel. Like, it's going to work when it happens. Could you make it happen more? Probably. Like, people meditate and shit. Like, I don't know anything about meditation, so I'm not going to go into that. But I imagine if you meditate and got right with your own mind, then maybe psychic abilities and psychic things in your life, not Bob's life across the street, because psychics... People think psychic, they think, well, you can read that person's mind. That's that's not the psychic I'm talking about. I don't even think that's the psychic she's talking about. She's talking about our psychic as a person. Me. My seeing things. Your seeing things. I don't believe you have to be in a certain way, like she was just saying. To have something psychic happen. Maybe it works better if you are in a certain way. This is my opinion. Damn, this video is already 12 minutes. Shit. We'll go a couple, we'll go another minute into this one. And I'll have to make this a two part one. Because I'm enjoying what she's talking what about. What does work is you have to clear your mind which is pretty hard to do in our age now because everyone has ADHD. I know I do in the head. Nobody has ADHD. It was just a fucking made-up thing so that they could give your kids pills to control them. There was no ADHD when I was a fucking kid. It's a way to control your kids. If you give your kids pills for ADHD... That's to control your kids. Let them be fucking kids. They only get to do it once in their lifetime. Let them be kids. But you got to clear your mind. And let go of all control. And let it... Okay, we're going to end this one here. There's going to be another part. Uh, because this one's already 13 minutes. Uh... I don't think I'm going to put this one in my members. I'm going to put this one out so everybody can see it. Because I agree with a lot of the shit she said in this. And I disagree with some of the shit she said in this. But maybe I'll probably put it in my members. Because her story I'm trying to do is just a member story. But I might put it out. We'll see. We'll see where I go with this.